Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Talk Sports in South Jersey. Let's get started by talking about our local teams first. Starting with the Philadelphia Eagles. They are on a short week. They will take on the Dallas Cowboys on Sunday. Let's get a win and stay in the playoff hunt! The Philadelphia Flyers are 11-12-2 on the season. They will take on the Columbus Blue Jackets on Thursday and Buffalo Sabres on Saturday. Let's rack up some wins! The Philadelphia 76ers are 17-8 on the season. They will take on the Toronto Raptors on Wednesday and Detroit Pistons on Friday. Let's get some wins and move up a spot in the Eastern Conference. The Tampa Owls take on the Duke Blue Devils in the Walk-Ons Independence Bowl on December 27th. The Tampa Owls in men's college basketball are 7-1 on the season. They will take on Villanova in a Pennsylvania showdown on Wednesday. Let's keep the winning streak going! T for Temple U! Fight, fight, fight for the cherry and the white! Villanova is 6-2 in their college basketball season. They will take on Temple on Wednesday and St. Joe's in a Battle of Pennsylvania on Saturday. Let's get win number seven. Nova, Nova, Nova. The Penn Quakers in men's college basketball are five and two on the season. They will take on Delaware State on Tuesday. Let's keep the winning streak going. The St. Joseph's Hawks are four and four on the season. They will take on Princeton on Wednesday and Villanova in a PA battle on Saturday. Let's get back in the win column. Go St. Joe's! LaSalle is 0-8 on the season. Not a good start. When will they get in the win column? They will take on Bucknell on Tuesday and Pennsylvania on Saturday. Let's win game number one! The Drexel Dragons are 4-4 four four on the season. They will take on Loyola Maryland on Wednesday and Maryland Baltimore City on Saturday. Let's win game number five! Go Drexel! Good luck to all our local teams! It's time to preview the 2018 NFL playoff picture. In the AFC, we have the Kansas City Chiefs are the number one seed. The New England Patriots are the second seed. The Houston Texans have the number three seed. The Pittsburgh Steelers have the number four seed. The Los Angeles Superchargers have seed number five. And the Baltimore Ravens have the sixth seed. In the NFC playoff, we have the Los Angeles Rams have the number one seed and clinched the NFC West. The New Orleans Saints have the number two seed. The Chicago Bears have the number three seed. The Dallas Cowboys have seed number four. The Seattle Seahawks have the fifth seed. And the Washington Redskins have the sixth seed. The Oakland Raiders and San Francisco 49ers are eliminated from playoff contention. The Philadelphia Eagles are still on the playoff hunt. They need to start winning games in order to make the playoffs. Can they win six straight games, including confrontations at Dallas and Washington? We will talk more about the NFL playoff picture next week. It's time to preview the 119th Army-Navy game. We are a few days from the 119th, 2018 Army-Navy game. The game between two of the United States' most prestigious military academies will be played in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania at Lincoln Financial Field. The Black Knights sit at 9-2 overall on the season, while the Midshipmen are 3-9 overall on the season, and are hoping to beat West Point, who has won the last two games. Before the last two victories in this game by Army, Navy had won every game from 2002 to 2015, the longest winning streak in the history of the series. While it is not known what Army will wear to the game, Navy special uniforms for the rivalry game accent the GOAT mascot that is used by the Academy. This will be the 119th meeting between West Point and the Naval Academy. Navy leads the all-time series 60-57. Seven games ending in a tie. Go Army! Beat Navy!
It's time to see how my picks look out for week 13 of the National Football League. I went 4-2. The Dallas Cowboys won and broke the Saints' winning streak. The Green Bay Packers lost to Arizona, while the New England Patriots and the Baltimore Ravens won their games. The Eagles are alive! They are still in the playoff hunt. It's week 14 of the NFL season. It's time to pick the top six games. Who will win the game on Thursday and Sunday? Starting with the Jacksonville Jaguars versus Tennessee Titans. The Jacksonville Jaguars snapped their seven-game losing streak, defeating the Indianapolis Colts 6-0. They are 4-8 on the season. For the Tennessee Titans, they are 6-6 six six on the season. They were down 16-0 in the second quarter. In the second half, they rallied for a 26-22 win over the New York Jets on a game-winning touchdown with 36 seconds remaining. I predict the Tennessee Titans to win the game and be above 500. Baltimore Ravens versus Kansas City Chiefs. The Baltimore Ravens are 7-5 on the season. They are in second place in the AFC North with a 26-16 win over the Falcons in Atlanta. The Kansas City Chiefs are back in the win column with a 40-33 win over the Raiders in Oakland. They have the number one seed in the AFC with a 10-2 record. I predict the Kansas City Chiefs to win the game and sack Joe Flacco. Chiefs, Chiefs, Chiefs! Atlanta Falcons versus Green Bay Packers. What has gotten into the Green Bay Packers this season? They are 4-7-1 on the season, losing on a missed field goal 20-17 to the Arizona Cardinals. After the game, Mike McCarthy was fired as head coach. He was 1-25-77-2. Joe Philbin will be the interim head coach for the rest of the season. For the Atlanta Falcons, they are 4-8 on the season, losing to Baltimore 26-16. I predict the Green Bay Packers to win the game and bounce back. Go Pack Go! New England Patriots versus Miami Dolphins and AFC East Showdown. The New England Patriots are 9-3 on the season and have first place in the AFC East. They currently have the second seed in the AFC. For the Miami Dolphins, they won 21-17 over the Buffalo Bills in Miami. The Dolphins have a 6-6 record and have second place in the AFC East. I predict the New England Patriots to win the game and sack Ryan Tannehill. Go Patriots! Philadelphia Eagles versus Dallas Cowboys and NSC East Showdown. The Philadelphia Eagles are coming off a short week heading into Sunday's matchup in Arlington. Will the Eagles beat the Cowboys and stay alive in the playoff race? For the Dallas Cowboys, they broke the Saints 10 game winning streak with a 13-10 win in Arlington. I predict the Philadelphia Eagles to win the game and stop Ezekiel Elliott. E-I-G-L-E-S Eagles! Los Angeles Rams versus Chicago Bears. The Los Angeles Rams clinched the NFC West with a huge 30-16 win over the Lions in Detroit. They are 11-1 on the season and have the number one seed in the NFC. For the Chicago Bears, they did not come away with the win, losing 30-27 against the German at MetLife Stadium. They are 8-4 on the season and still at first place in the NFC North. I predict the Los Angeles Rams to win their 12th consecutive game. Go LA! Go LA! Check in next week and we will see how everyone did. That is a wrap. You can check me out on my podcast at Stefan Sports Radio or through the podcast app or this YouTube channel. And you can listen to me on Saturday nights at 6 o'clock on 1360 WNJC in Cherry Hill. Thank you for watching and keep those comments rolling and we will talk to you next week.